Hello people, this is your friend Anurag and we are making an awesome green smoothie today. In my last video, I have clearly talked about the different kind of vitamins, the water soluble ones and the fat soluble ones. And I talked how water soluble vitamins are not stored in our body and you need them almost every day. So the smoothie that we are going to make today will take care of all your vitamin needs, the water soluble ones. So guys, let us have a look at all those ingredients we are going to put in a mighty smoothie today. Ingredient number one, flax seeds. Flax seeds produce a flying gas with, uh, I guess, some vitamin B1. Next ingredient, spinach. Spinach essentially would be supplying us with, I guess, vitamin B2, uh, B6 maybe, B7 and B9. So spinach is very important, you know. And then we have almonds. Almonds would be supplying us with some quality vitamin B3. Some tomatoes, you know, nice ripe tomatoes, they're supplying us with some vitamin B5. And the last uh, list of uh, last, you know, last in the list of ingredients is basically papaya. Papaya is going to supply us with some, you know, vitamin C. Very tasty. Put around, you know, one to two teaspoons of uh, flax seeds. Uh, in a blender so that we can ground it properly and it becomes powdered in form. See our flaxseed is nicely ground. We're going, to, we're going to put that into a smoothie flask. Did that. Take was the first ingredient. Alright, I don't know how many of you have tried almond milk but all those who have tried, you know, it's really expensive. But you know what? It's really very simple to make almond milk at home. I'll show you how. All you need is around, you know, six to eight almonds or 10 almonds, whatever you think uh, will suit you. And then you put some water and blend it all. I'll show you how it is done. Now second ingredient, almonds, they are basically ready in the form of almond milk and we will be using them now. So now up till, up till now, uh, a smoothie has ground flax seeds and almond milk. Now guys, we will be mixing the rest of the ingredients into the smoothie, you know, spinach, tomato and some papaya too. As you can see, see the smoothie is getting ready. And one more thing, you know, you, you can even add a lemon for you know for the vitamin C content, obviously, but it will also aid in digestion. So it's awesome to add some lemon. Now all you have to do is you know close the lid and blend it. As you can see, it's just like very concentrated. It's a nutritional powerhouse. You can you can add a little bit of water into it and then blend it again. It depends on you know how you'd like to. I have to agree. It's not the best tasting smoothie in the world, but as far as your water soluble vitamins are concerned, it's loaded with that. Right? With the exception of vitamin B12, this smoothie has all the water soluble vitamins. The reason I didn't put any vitamin B12 food source into it is because milk and eggs are basically, you know, uh, they are the primary sources of vitamin B12. And it's strictly advisable not to mix your fruits and veggies with milk. So guys, do give this smoothie a try and tell me, you know, uh, did you like it or not. So, I'll be seeing you next time. Till then, bye-bye.